certain programming languages are more likely to net you a technology job than others. For Tech Republic and ZDNet, I'm Dan Patterson with Tech Republic's Allison Donesco Rayom, and these are the top programming languages of 2018. Allison, what does the programming job market look like right now? Well, demand for programmers and developers is extremely high right now, and we have a pretty low supply. So if you're someone in this field, it's a great time to be looking for a job. Um, we know that demand for especially front-end, back-end, mobile, and full-stack developers have all skyrocketed over the past year. And the field itself is growing faster than most others, according to the U.S. Bureau of Labor and Statistics. So what are the three most in-demand programming languages right now? Well, according to a new report from Coding Dojo, the top three are Java being number one, and though it's actually gone down in terms of the number of job openings, it's still the most established and widely used programming language for a lot of developers. I believe it's in use by millions of developers and billions of devices across the world. So that's definitely a good choice if you're looking to learn a new language. Uh, number two is Python. There were 5,000 more job listings involving Python skills this year since last year. And it's used a lot in data mining and machine learning. So I think the increase that we're seeing in companies using those technologies has really led to an increase in Python use. And finally, we are seeing a lot of jobs for JavaScript. We know that more than 80% of developers and 95% of websites use JavaScript. So that's another popular option. And what's the best way to get started learning a programming language and breaking in right now? There are a bunch of different ways to do it. Um, some experts really recommend a three-pronged approach that includes some individual training, which might be learning through a coding boot camp or an online course or even just a book, and then finding some kind of project that really motivates you and will get you to try things out and break things and learn from your mistakes. And finally, experts also recommend finding a community of other developers and people who are learning you can ask questions of and just kind of run your projects off of to really figure out what you're doing. So as digital transformation impacts every single industry, there's never been a better time to break into programming. For more information about how you can get started with technology programming, make sure to visit Tech Republic. And while you're there, subscribe to the Tech Republic Next Big Thing newsletter.